What were you doing to that thing? It's a rock. So you were gonna eat it? <laughs> okay, what is it? This is called a crinoid. Well, this is a crinoid. Hi, crinoid. All right. He is old. He's older than my mom and dad. He's older than me. He's older what? than my... Yeah. You know what's crazy? Well, your mom's only 25, so I, I mean... If I was a fossil, okay, and somebody sold me for a buck, I'd be offended. Valid. If I was 250 million years old and I'm only worth a dollar, that's a bit of an insult. This guy, we got 250 bucks on him. Yes. But what I want to teach you about this is the restoration work that goes into these crinoids. Because some people look at a lot of the Moroccan stuff and they're like, oh, it's fake, it's fake, it's fake, it's fake, blah, 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 it's fake, it's fake. No, 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 Not no. necessarily, no. that's right. There are carvings and there are artistic facielles that they make, but there are real fossils. Now, this one here is actually a kill zone. Wow, when I use the term kill zone, it's actually literally an ancient bed of crinoids that were covered up in a really fine silt. Now this rock... Because that's a crinoid there, right? Yeah, it's a crinoid. There's some now these are crinoid stems. stems. This is a stem. See, so this is just the more important or interesting <laughs> fossil of yeah. them. He wasn't as cool. He's pretty cool, but yeah. they didn't actually excavate so him. What they do is they physically split the layers. When the rock is it's, it's warped, it doesn't split straight. So I they're, see that. They're a nightmare to split. You can see all the oh, pieces look, look they were in. look at all the fossils on the back. Yeah, but you see the... The, the, you see where they have put all the restoration work? They yes. put piece them all back together. So they, they glue them all back together. They, they, uh, and they make a, make a, basically put the plate back together. And then what they do is they actually paint this. This is all painted. And this is painted. They paint the fossil to give it some... Okay, so what they're doing then mm -hmm. is it's not that they're actually creating a fossil. What they're doing is they're actually minimizing the look of the background fossil. That's right so that they can accent the look of the primary fossil that they want to draw your eye that's to. That's right. That's exactly it. Like you can see the paint level right there, right? Right. Yeah. It's, they do that to accent it. But yeah, these are a, these are a, a, a bugger to, to make, but or like when they make them and they put them back together. But the larger plates of these guys, they actually have a fiberglass mesh and concrete on the back. In order to actually over. preserve that fossil to that they can it, work with. To keep it together. Yeah. They're, they're, they're a lot of work. When we were there in the Sahara, where they find these, the near our foot, they uh, they pull out these large blocks, and they have to physically chisel the blocks apart in order to, to get these crinoids to, to pop out. So, so the detail's important. If you can't see that detail when you're looking at one of these, that's when you would question it, right? Exactly. Like the tiny little things <laughs> here, the yep. little uh, stems that's coming through. Those are legit. That's, that's your giveaway. Yep. Yeah, those are legit. Very cool. Thank you. You're welcome.